Hello, hello, my friends, and welcome to my channel. Smile, there is mine. Emily here. I hope you're all doing fabulous out there. Check out my cute new cup on Clown Wine. Got it at Target. Love it. Want to share it with you guys because you all know me. Hey guys, if you're joining me today, you noticed in the thumbnail that we are going to be doing a Stitch Fix unboxing. Now, if you watch me, you know that I just got a March Stitch Fix box. Um, but it was just kind of a meh box, as I said. There wasn't anything in there that was super exciting. So I asked you guys for your opinions and you gave me some great comments. And I just thought, you know, I'm just going to send everything back. There was nothing in there that was like, buy me, keep me, put me in your closet. Um, so I sent everything back and then Stitch Fix sent me a quick email that said, hey, do you want to do a quick fix? And I'm like, uh, yeah, let's do it. So they restyled me and sent me off a box right away. And so I am excited to see what is in this box. So you guys might be wondering, well, didn't you get charged that $20 styling fee? And I actually have something called the Style Pass, so I did not get charged that. And what the Style Pass is, is you pay $50, about $50 um, for the year. That $50 does get credited back to anything you purchase, and it just allows you to not have to pay that $20 styling fee for every box. So I like that because if there's a box, like my last one, that was just not... Um, there wasn't anything in there that I truly loved, then I'm able to send it all back without getting ding that $20 styling fee. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump in and see what my stylist Heather sent me this time. Okay. I'm not going to include all the information on Stitch Fix. I figure... If you're watching this, you pretty much know everything about Stitch Fix, but you can also find that information below. If you've never done Stitch Fix, I'm going to highly recommend that you use someone's referral link um, for your first time because you will save some additional money, and that's always fun, right? You don't have to use my link. It is provided below if you want to, and thank you if you do, um, but just use somebody. Save yourself that little bit of extra money. Pretty much anything I do now, I'm looking for a referral link or a code from somebody because, you know, it's fun. It's like a coupon. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and take a look at what we have going on here. I do see a lot of spring colors. I'm um, not sure. Wow, that's got a lot going on. Got some purple, some blue, some jeans. Okay. Um, this time I kind of changed up what I was asking for from my stylist. I just said I want like modern, boutique-y items, new, fresh. So we will see what her take on that is. Um, I'm hoping Stitch Fix is getting better with their inventory, maybe getting some new items, um, more modern. I don't know. Sometimes I feel like their stuff is getting a little dated. So hopefully they're just waiting for spring to turn over some new things. So let's go ahead and jump on it. Actually, before I jump into this, I want to read the note and make sure it's still from Heather and see what she has to share to me. Okay, it is Heather. Here we go. Hi, Emily. Happy Fix Day. I was so thrilled to see your name come across my desk again. Thank you for the feedback and helpful request note. It helped me to hone in on some new items for you today. Let's dive in. I think you'll love the modern style of the button detail skirt from Lise. This can be paired with heels for a night out look or flats for a more casual day look. Style this two ways with the white blouse from your all white box a few fixes ago, yes, or a v-neck top from Nine Britain, I included also. Uh, this top ups the ante on the simple black tee with the stylish v-necks and not in a knot twist at the bottom. I know you have a self-proclaimed jeans obsession, so today I wanted to pass along this boot cut pair from Judy Bloom for you to add to your class collection. Looking forward to your unboxing on YouTube. Cheers, Heather. Awesome. Um, oh, it does sound, sounds like there's going to be some fun things in here. I'm not going to look at the prices yet because I'm cheap and I don't want to get jaded. Um, let's jump in. Okay, so this first top is by, it's a top, I think, by West Key. There is a lot going on here. It's kind of boho-ish. It does have the tab sleeves, three-quarter length, cute. I'm either going to love this or hate this. I'm not sure. Cute tie at the bottom. Actually, I'm liking it more. The buttons, It's it's this is fun. So we'll see how this fits. Um, it's funny because sometimes I pull this out and I'm like, oh, is this my mother? Because <laughs> she likes wild, big, bold print 
super colorful. So it's like, I don't know, you know how it is with moms and stuff. You like um, like it, but then you're like, I don't know if I can be able to do that. But anyways, I digress. Um, this is cute. Okay, I'm excited to try that on. All right, next is this purple. Pretty. Is this the skirt? Oh my gosh, I wonder what fell over out there. Can you see that? <laughs> Something fell over outside. Okay, so next there is this purpley print with these little white dot flowers. Um, this is by 41, uh, 41 Hawthorne. It is a size medium. What is this? This is a wrap dress. Very cute. Very cute. Is that pockets? I'll have to try it on. Um, it doesn't go very long, but it is that really nice, um, kind of like bouncy material. Fun. Okay. That's cute too. Okay. This next top is by Nine Britain. It's just a Blace, basic black v-neck t-shirt which you know you can always use more of these oh it has the tie knot at the bottom so that makes it a little bit different all right we'll try that out I'm not sure if I'm liking the tie knot at the bottom anymore it just depends on how it fits and lays okay next we have um I think this is the skirt I want to say this is lace or lice. <laughs> um, cute blue skirt, kind of like a pencil skirt with the little buttons. So yeah, I've been looking for some more skirts. Feels like a really nice stretchy material. Excited to try that on. So far I'm excited about all these pieces. I have never had a pair of jeans by Judy Bloom, but let's check it out. Um, it has a nice dark print to it or dark um, wash to it. And it seems pretty long. Let's see if there's any distressing. Nope. And it is, I don't know if this is a boot cut or what. Oh, it is boot cut. So I'm kind of interested in more like the cropped boot cut. Um, but we will see how these fit and how they look. All right, let's go and jump into the try-in. Okay, here we are, and we're going to be starting off with these two pieces. Let's talk about this blouse first. I love it. I think it, when I first pulled it out, I was like, wow, it's really loud. <laughs> it's a little wild, but I think it has a really fun boho vibe to it. Um, so let's go ahead and get a little bit closer, take a look at the details. Um, I'm okay with the roll tab sleeve. I'm fine with that. I really like the tie right here. I think that adds a fun element to it. It's cute little buttons. Um, yeah, so this top right now, loving. Let's go ahead, and I forgot the name of it, so I'll do that in the recap. Um, let's talk about these jeans by Judy Bloom. Never have tried jeans on like this before. Not um, not like this, but Judy Bloom, Judy Bloom jeans before. Um, so let's see. They fit nice. They're okay. Y'all know me. Too short. Already the length will not work for me. I need it longer. I'm not opposed to boot cut. Okay, here I am with this skirt. And I did pair it like she recommended with this blouse that I got about two boxes ago from Stitch Fix. This top is by Daniel Rain. It is amazing. I love it. Um, but let's talk about this skirt. So it's cute. It's a nice classic pencil skirt. I like the blue and the white of it. It makes it very like springy um, and the buttons are fun. It adds a nice little detail. It has a little cutout right there. It's very cute. I think it's sexy. Um, I think it's okay. Sometimes pencil skirts kind of cut right into the tummy. So that's not always fun, but I think it's really cute. I'm just, you know, I feel like if I was more of a business professional for sure but I'm not so I want skirts but I think just because this is like a pencil skirt um, I'm getting kind of more of that businessy vibe which I like but I'm not sure if it's something that I need so we'll check out price on that on to the next Okay, here I am with this wrap dress by 41 Hawthorne, and there's just something you gotta love about a cute wrap dress. I think it makes all silhouettes 
um, and all body types just have a really nice, pretty silhouette. Um, I think this is a beautiful burgundy color um, with these white little flowers that pop through. Um, it's a nice conservative wrap, so it's not opening up. Nice sleeves that you can wear with um, a full bra, so you don't have to go strapless or anything like that. Little wrap here. Um, it does have underlining, which is nice. Um, so it's very cute. I'm just not sure if it's something that I need at this point in time. But, um, yeah, I think it's adorable. Okay, we have one more piece. Okay, I'm here with the last piece. This is just a simple black tee by Nine Britain. It does have um, the little knot tie here in the side and the v-neck. Um, so, I don't know. It's a nice, simple piece. It feels like really great quality. Um, I just paired it with these Vagos jeans that I did get in a Stitch Fix a while back. I love these jeans. They're nice and long. Um, and here's the problem. Sometimes it creates a smooth effect and I like that, but then other times it can kind of like, you know, do that. And I don't like that. So this one seems to fit nicely with the little tie knot right there, but I don't know. I feel like I'm not really into this tie knot experience anymore. I'm just like, if I wanted it that way, I would just probably just do kind of a little front tuck or something. So I don't know. We'll check out pricing. All right. See you then. Ah, stitch fix strapper. <laughs> All right. We're back. Let's check it out. Let's see what we think about these prices. Okay. We'll start with the Judy Bloom cut jeans. Um, I liked the color. I liked the whiskering. I liked the fit. Um, except it was just too short and the length, the length was just too, length, uh, the length was just too short. So these are going to be a no, but they are called the Judy Blue Lynn Boot Cut Jean and in Indigo size six for $58. Not a bad price. Um, this is the wrap dress. This is called Mix by 41 Hawthorne, Cassidy a Faux Wrap in Purple, size medium, $54. Also, not a bad price. Thoughts on this? Mm, I just don't know if I need it. I think it's cute. I'll think about it. Um, the lease, Raven Button Detail Skirt, blue, medium, $74. Um, yeah, that's gonna be a no. I just, I think it's good quality. I think it's a cute skirt. I just feel like it's a little elevated style professional and I'm just a teacher. So I like to wear skirts, but maybe more like flowy, you know, teacher skirts. <laughs> All right. And then the shirt I have on is the Nine Britain Levy V neck top in black size medium, $34. Great price. Really great price. Um, again, I'm just don't know about that tie knot and I'm not really sure I need another black tea I have quite a few so pass on that one now this one was the clear winner I think you guys knew that I really like this one it was cute this is the West Key uh Talina tie front blouse in orange size medium $44 so I think that this is going to be what I'm keeping this round super cute um if I decided to keep everything in my box the total would be $264 they would take away that 25% discount which is totally awesome um and yeah, so it would end up being around $198, which is great because I always like to keep things under $200 in my box. So it ends out being about each item would be around $40. So that's a really good deal. Um, I'm still yet to get that five out of five experience. So yeah, that's a bummer. But I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful. I'm very hopeful. Anyways, thanks you guys so much for watching and I hope you're all doing great out there. If you like what you see and you like me, consider subscribing to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!